all a bit of a head spinner, isn't it? AI is giving everything, including my brain, a radical reboot. It's basically back to the classroom for a lot of us. But if you thought you and me and the students have it tough adapting to this digital first intelligent world, spare a thought for the teachers. Because even that most traditional of sectors, education, is having to learn everything afresh. AI is fundamentally changing what it means to teach as the educational operating system gets rewritten in real time. Luckily, Huawei Connect Europe here in Madrid is playing host to a couple of expert tutors. Hi, I am Zoltan Reinli from the Obuda University. I am Vice Rector of General Affairs. Hello, I am Marian Getcher from Huawei Technologies Hungary. I am responsible for public affairs. So what brings a top Hungarian university together with a global tech company? How did the partnership come about? We think uh, uh, the university is very important, uh, the participation and uh, the friendship and uh, collaboration with the uh, companies um, and uh, with the industry partners. Approximately uh, 10 uh, years ago, we started uh, the cooperation with uh, Huawei uh, we started uh, the first step uh, in uh, the cooperation and uh, discuss how can we develop the telecommunication systems of the, of the university and how can we use the new technology in uh, the education. So I think uh, this uh, cooperation is a long uh, tradition and uh, we think it's a very, very, very good uh, cooperation with uh, Huawei. Okay, it was step by step, small steps first, and now it's a multi-layered uh, relationship with uh, with lot of opportunities also for the future. And uh, actually, the university was the first in Hungary who started to use our Wi-Fi 7 uh, technology in their campuses, which is huge. Well, obviously, it's a, it's a partnership that's working, but more broadly, in terms of the digital, the intelligent transformation of education, is that now an inevitable trend? And how is it playing out in, in your university and universities more widely? In Hungary, uh, the university uh, started uh, first uh, uh, use the, uh, the AI technology to help for the students. We think uh, the AI technology and the cloud te technology together can uh, help for us in uh, the education and the researches, and our campus has a, a global uh, system, AI and uh, cloud and uh, Wi-Fi uh, technologies. Very important to, to create, first step, uh, the uh, AI uh, strategy at the Obuda University. Why? Because uh, we think uh, in the strategy, we can uh, uh, write about the future plan uh, to, uh, to develop the systems of the Obuda University. After that, uh, we think uh, the AI technology can help uh, not only in administration works, but uh, to, to help uh, for the students in uh, the education because they uh, can find uh, documents, can find the knowledge uh, with the help of the AI technology. Over the university in the strategy uh, fixed, the AI technology is not enemy, it's a friend. Uh, in the researches and the education. And is Huawei Cloud being a friend in, in addressing those pain points? Absolutely, we say yes. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. Uh, the, the cloud technology is very important because uh, to, uh, to find um, the data, to uh, save uh, the data and uh, uh, manage uh, all data of the student and the uh, uh, workers is uh, very important and uh, we can use all data on time, uh, not important uh, the places. Actually, it's very, very nice to see that uh, how, how AI and our cloud is uh, supporting the education at Obuda University. And just to mention that, that uh, it's not only that students get pers personalized uh, education, follow-up, encouragement, recommendations and so on, but also can help substitute the pro professors, sorry to say. <laughs> but, but Your job be, is safe. yes, because when when they because AI can automatically rank the students, can give them the the uh, the assessment and so on. So this is, I think, also 
one big one big advantage besides thanks to ai and it, it become an assisting technology for example when there are disabled persons or some uh, diseases who cannot hear well or who cannot read well like this kind of this kind of students get the same opportunity with ai to study the same materials in that quality how it was intended and and bearing in mind hungary's national ai strategy how else is huawei cloud and its solutions helping other industries not just education across hungary uh, Hungary has a dedicated uh, uh, government commissioner for AI and he and his team implemented and developed the AI strategy. And he is coming from, uh, from the education sector originally. So they think and Hungary thinks that AI is very, very important. But most importantly, we have to educate the people, the communities, not to be afraid of AI, because it's here, it's like the calculator, you know, that when it was in invented, we were very happy that we don't have to calculate everything in our, in our heads. And this will happen, this should happen with AI as well. So this is actually the university, very major AI strategy is matching with the aim of the country, how to use AI. Yeah, so it's about embracing this change. And in the years ahead, what are your ambitions for AI and new technologies at the university? And, and indeed, what's your ambition for the partnership with Huawei? Uh, in the partnership, uh, we think uh, together with uh, Huawei, uh, we, we will have uh, capacities to develop the education systems. We, we can uh, uh, develop uh, and we can continue the development uh, of the, the systems and uh, education possibilities. Uh, to um, uh, digital transformation. Uh, over the university is a very important uh, role in, in the education because in Hungary is the first uh, technical university and uh, the other universities in Hungary would like to follow the, the first university. Uh, we think uh, we, we will have a new uh, representatives of the EI strategy uh, in the higher education. Final word to you in this partnership? Oh, it, this is just the beginning of a beautiful friendship, you know. So, and, and it's already lasting for 10 years. So, yes, for AI and cloud, there are, there are plenty of opportunities, you know, for, uh, to use. And, uh, yes, and to check what can, be, what can be the next level of this uh, cloud and AI cooperation. We do. you got that spontaneous applause for Yes, your yes, thank you <laughs> very much. Thank yeah, you. yeah. Thanks both very thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks.